Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing the BH Mimosa palette. Since I think my outfit will look cute with it, I'm going to show you my outfit. <laughs> so I thought the um, palette would look so cute with this outfit. It's like a romper. So that's what I'll be wearing today. And the color story. So Again, I'll show you my outfit, and I thought this would be a good way to wear this palette. So what do you think? <laughs> um, <clears throat> I'm a little sick still from, you know, my throat acting up, my sinuses, all thanks to getting older and allergies. It's gotten worse. So yay. Uh, I never had such horrible allergies like this before it's just weird so i'm gonna go in with chilled before i start anything so this white shade so yeah <clears throat> having sore throats common <laughs> i'm just gonna go underneath the eyes though just because i have such dark 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 circles they're hard to cover up. And I like to use the white just to cover them up a bit. And the setting like powders never really do anything for me underneath the eye. And that's where I like to use the translucent powders. But they don't do nothing. But yeah, I was surprised to even find this palette. Because sometimes they just lack of restocking. Or they have like a bunch of makeup heart revolutions. I don't know my sinuses. <laughs> makeup um makeup revolution, I heart um revolution, oh my gosh. I I'm just my brain is just out of it. Um, but yeah. <laughs> oh, my hair is just, I'm just going to put it back, even though I don't like it back. So yeah, I Heart Revolution, there we go. Um, and I'm just like, I want to move past. I had the Batman palette, but the yellow seemed to be so messy and it probably broke so i was like no i'm not getting the batman <coughs> excuse me revolution palette that was a big burp because i am drinking pepsi so now i'm gonna go in with vibes that pink shade so yeah, it's going into the crease with the shade. I don't know. Um, I do love Marshalls more than Ross. First, I used to like Ross a lot, but then Marshalls appeared, and I was like, ooh. Let's try them and they have better makeup selection, better like purses and other stuff. I really am wanting to get a purse. I want a like, color purse. Like I've been wanting like a coral purse. I think that would look cute with this outfit. <laughs> I think I want like more of a coral. I've seen like a mint color. No, it was coral. Yeah, I think it was coral. I don't know. It's a little handbag I thought was so cute. And I was like, I should have got it. It was like $10. It's just like a little handbag. Just, I, you know, you don't need big bags. I have tons of big bags. I don't wear. I'm gonna go on with OJ. Orange juice. 
I don't drink orange juice anymore. <laughs> Ever since acid, I had acid. It's just on like above. Um, ever since I had acid, like, onions, I barely eat unless it's, like, vinegared. i put on my tacos. Um, or cooked onion. Um, orange juice is just too sour. Also, it's, like, really old. <laughs> It's like been really sour for me. Going back with vibes. Just mixing them in together. So yeah. I love BH. It's so pigmented. I was even surprised with the palettes that I first bought from BH and that was like Ross for like $15. I thought it was such a great deal and so pigmented with, you know, the addition ones. They're so good. I'm going to go in with, they don't really have like a deep, deep shade. So I'm going to go in with a raspberry, the shade right here. BH is just so, like, I don't know. Like, it's between, like, ColourPop is different in its own way. Like, but it could be between ColourPop, Glam White. Like, the mattes are just so beautiful. And I didn't, you know, get into ColourPop that much in the beginning of my makeup journey, I guess. <laughs> Cause it's a journey, like I'm still like wanting to explore other brands. Um, there's like a lot of indie brands out there that are like, it should be in Sephora and Ulta. Like Minus, they need a Minus, Urban Decay, they need a Minus. <laughs> um, like a lot and just get indie brands like Mount Cosmetics. Is that Sephora? But I don't see it in store. Maybe I need to go to the mall. <laughs> but I'm excited that my palettes have shipped from Melt. One palette from Melt and one palette from Odin's Eye. But it's like... Odin's Eye should be at Sephora too. I think they're getting a little bit bigger that everybody's like really interested if more higher YouTubes, YouTubers talk more about it. They should end up being it at Sephora so it's like right there instead of waiting for it to like ship and wait like a week or two. Somewhere around there, that's what it's looking like. I really like this orangey pink vibe. So pretty, so thirsty. I don't think I went to bed at like until three, so I'm barely waking up. Yep, I'm crazy. <laughs> but it's like, I don't do anything. I film and clean. And I am gonna like post like today is what? Thursday the 19th and I'm gonna be posting it today. So I'm up to like date on my videos and it's not pre-filming so I'm happy about that. So let's see what we can get. Maybe the rest of the eye. Yeah. I'll color the rest of the eye. One color. So I'm going to go in with probably this Project Pan. 
like, I'm like probably gonna leave these in so they don't like go bad. I have like plenty of mirrors in front of me. I'm gonna go in with this pink first. Gotta use some project pan stuff, right? Allergies are so kicking my butt this year. I was like, oh no, I hope I don't get sick. <laughs> like something horrible, but it's just allergies and it's like, I feel like I am sick. It's just runny nose, my eyes get watery. Like I hate any kind of fan on during the daylight. <coughs> Like when I'm watching TV and stuff, man, I am burping. <laughs> I'm going to go in with Pop, this shade right here, for the rest of my lid. That's why I put like this kind of pink on. Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? But yeah. I'm going to have to fix that. That's so pretty. <laughs> there, BH formula. So sad they went out of business, and the wrong people bought them. I feel, uh, I feel betrayed. <laughs> That they accepted it, but you know, what else are they going to do? Wish they could have like went a different route instead of. Um, singers do makeup, I don't know. Like food themes are like the best. Like like the these sixteen pants, they did awesome. They should have just kept with just that instead of like doing the wrong um collaborations. They should have done like other collaborations. I like it. It's pretty. Okay. Uh, mm. Think about what I did my project pan. I haven't touched my project pan this week. That's sad. <laughs> um, I'm going to go in probably... I was thinking doing like the whole lid with this shade because I want to hit pan in this shade so bad. But maybe I will do something. Hmm. I wanted to play with this with the lid. Beautiful. Hmm. Probably just ruined it. We'll see. Pretty though. We'll see. Yeah. Just I haven't been really up to anything. Just enjoying my time. And it feels good. <laughs> Started the dropout on Hulu. At first I was like, hmm, I don't know about this show, but I kept watching and watching because sometimes you just gotta, you know, 
weigh it out a little bit, just like skincare and stuff. <laughs> um, just weigh it out and see how that takes you. I'm gonna go in with this. Um, so the dropout is crazy. Trust me. I know what they're doing is not easy. It does not look easy. Just, <laughs> you know, that's so good though. I'm like, I wanted to finish <laughs> the show, but I'm like, we'll probably finish it tonight. We, we binge watch and I'm like, okay, it's one o'clock in the morning. I got to get ready for bed. I'm getting so tired. But then I ended up sleeping, like going to bed at, at three. It's funny. But, man. It turned out to be good. For like a little more than halfway finished with the show and I'm like I want more. Where's more like true story kind of shows? Oh got candy, the dropout now, um just all these True stories is just so good. I want to go in with so many shadows. I think with this one, City Color. I, I had this for so many years and it's still buttery smooth. Love the shade. So yeah, it's been good. I really get into these shows because it's like, oh, what happens next? Because it's a true story, so I'm like, let's see how crazy they actually get. <laughs> I think green is pretty with it. With this palette. Just something. Okay, and then I want to go in with this wipe off the green so you have to brighten it up in the corner I'm gonna have to bring that white pencil let's see all right <laughs> going in the way Ugh. All right, and go with this pencil. That <laughs> that's a whole, my pencil. Going in with Sunny right here, that yellow. I think I like matte in the corner so every time i put shimmer it just goes like down here and i'm like no <laughs> today i should be babysitting my mom's dog dog sitting um so she could go to the movies I'm like it's been so quiet without Lena. I don't know. 
my cats have been really calm and once you know Lena comes, Lena is just barking. She hates anyone that like drives by. Then she starts barking. I think that looks good. I don't know if I want to add any more because I don't want to add shimmer. I'm going to add a little bit of OJ just right here. Kind of mix the yellow and the orange together. Right there. All right. So yeah, I think I'm going to go in with my waterline. Brighten that up. Love this color. I might have to repurchase that color. <laughs> Going in with my Lancome underneath. I think it's just getting less and less product on this so it's fully. It's like. But yeah, um, not much going on today with me. Yesterday, clean, real good. Try to keep it clean. I'm like, whatever mess I make, I better clean it up. So, just to make it, you know, nice for me. I like that. And then I'm going with these Dior's. Um, this is the Dior Show Maximizer 3D Primer. This um, influencer sent me these to test out. Uh, I don't know. They keep, you know, updating their stuff. So I have no idea how to review anything. So... <laughs> I'm like, okay. They like really did something for me to not understand how to do things. And then I'm going in with the mascara. Ugh, RVs. I hate when they block the road with their IVs. I'm like, no. <laughs> Especially when the mailbox is just right there and they block so I can't see if the mail has ever came or not. That's frustrating because it's like, whatever packages we get is going to melt. <laughs> Like with pinch me, they'll send me like chocolates or something. I'm like, they need to send it like around winter time. <laughs> if they're gonna send me anything that's gonna melt, send it in the winter time. Like it gets cold, but not cold enough to snow here. So I'm, I haven't seen snow in a very long time now. It's like I go to Payson and I always told John, can we go to Payson? Can we go to Payson? He's like, yeah, we'll make plans, but never succeed. And that's why, like, the downfall of every, like, like, yeah, okay, you're telling, like, I'm a little kid, like, we're going to do something, and then we never do. <laughs> I'm like, no, when we say we're going to do something, we got to do something, because telling them that our relationship is hurting we need to do something he says it's fine <laughs> i'm like 
No, we don't do anything. We don't even talk. How do you think? He can't even answer me. I'm like, mm. So, this had to happen. Him moving out. And see if it changes anything. But so far, I only heard it for a couple times yesterday and nothing. <laughs> no more texts. Not even a call. So, I do my own thing and he's going to do his own thing. So this is my final look. I like the green added underneath because I did need to use my project pants. And I'm glad I used that like reddish purpley shade from my project pan. I thought this was cute. Just like between the matte and the shimmer. I thought this was really nice added on. So um, you don't have to necessarily use palette fully. You can use other things. You can use two palettes. Because it's like, then why did you buy like an all shimmer palette or an all matte palette if it's missing shimmers? Add shimmers. Like, you don't have to actually use this one palette to do a complete look. Like, I think higher YouTubers are just like, um, the, I don't like this. I don't use it because it doesn't have a shimmer in it. I'm like, why'd you get it then? <laughs> You can add another palette to it or like because when they declutter it's like oh um, it was limited edition and i'm like with limited edition you need to keep it <laughs> if you really like it not just because you're not decluttering just because it's like you can't buy it no more who cares if you can't buy it no more everybody dupes things nowadays they could dupe like oh they can look up the palette look up the picture blow it up and Blow up the swatches, that's what I do. I'm like, with the new releases, or like, oh, that's too bad I missed that palette, and I would like to dupe it. People can do that, you know? Why just toss it just because they don't sell it anymore? I'm like, people dupe, like, indie brands that is, like, expensive and hard to get, you know? I'm just saying, like, I hate when, you know... The higher YouTubers, like, I can't get it to this in the water, so I'm going to declutter it. I'm like, so? <laughs> Keep it because you like it, not just because you can't get it anymore. I don't know. I'm just like, really? <laughs> I'm like, if you're not reaching for it, that's a different story. But not just because it's a limited edition, you know. I have a lot of palettes people can't get, but you can actually dupe it. <laughs> so yeah, that is like, I'm on a fence of people decluttering. Because you can, you know, either way you can dupe it. But I really like this eyeshadow. Um, Yeah. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. But if you can't find this anywhere, try your Marshalls. I just got this in Marshalls and I feel like Arizona is like the last shipment for everything like Lisa Frank cookies I couldn't find that for like months and then it the last minute it just oh it appeared and I'm like it's not cool anymore <laughs> so I feel like Arizona is like the last person to get any kind of shipment into any kind of stores like um Care Bears. That's overdone. Like, um, the Wet n Wild Care Bears, the Wet n Wild SpongeBob. Nowhere to be found in Arizona. <laughs> For where I can see, I can't find cool stuff. <laughs> so this is really good. I really like it. I can't wait to play more into this because I want to play in the champagne color. It's like an orange shimmer. I didn't even do swatches. I'm sorry. I'm just so out of it. But I'm pretty sure everybody has seen this palette and swatches and everything. I really like it. Maybe the next time I wear this palette, I'll do swatches. But, you know, 
So I just wanted to play with some color and play with some of my project pan and yeah, that this would look really pretty from what I am wearing today. So 30 minutes into it. Wow. Bye for now. <laughs>